Hey, good morning everybody and welcome back to the channel. I know today you're interested in the Baofeng UV 5R radios and we're going to talk about those today some more and show you some other options that you can get with them. Don't forget to check out the links down below the video and yes they are affiliate links and I get paid just a little bit if you buy one. You don't make much money on a YouTube video unless it goes viral and gets two or three million hits and then you get ten bucks. So if you do click on one of the little links below I do make a little bit of change from that. Just get telling you that up front. But I bought these to use and I'm using them. And I'm going to show you how to put one in the van and use it uh, and also and using a magnetic top mount antenna that will get you a little bit more distance and a little bit more reception when you're in your vehicle whether you're car truck van whatever it is and uh, so let's take a look at it and see how that works out you can also put one of these antennas at your house and mount it outside and run the cable inside to your radio and that'll give you some more uh, distance and receiving better with your Baofeng UV 5R handheld radio. <laughs> so you take this antenna off and you just screw this antenna in and now you have that size of an antenna. Whew, that's a lot better. And you have all this cable that you can put it pretty much anywhere you want to. We're going to try this out on the old minivan and see how it works in the minivan. I showed you before my rooftop antenna for my CB radio and there it is. You can see it over there. And, and I also showed you my CB radio that's stuck down in here between the seats my CB radio that nobody talks on anymore and even with a rooftop antenna like I have it just does not get out very well now we're going to the family radio and the GMRS radio right there the bow thing and I've replaced the standard antenna with a magnetic rooftop antenna I'm going to put that on top of the van and see what it looks like. So now I'll put my little antenna up on the roof here. A little magnetic. As you can see, that's where the CB radio antenna's been. And for the radio to mount it inside the van, it was very easy. Because all I did was use the belt clip and clipped it right there on the sun visor. Just like that. And then I just run the cord along the ceiling and up to the roof. So now we have our Baofeng base radio or mobile radio mounted in the van. Very easy. It takes about two seconds to unclick it, get the antenna off, and you'll have it down and out of the van and out on the trail with it or wherever you want to go. Let's turn it on and see how it does. Channel mode. Ooh, it's in channel mode. Working. And that's how you turn a handheld Bofang radio into a mobile radio in your van or a base station at your house. By just adding a little antenna, it'll make a world of difference and you'll be happy. So stay tuned for my next video. And what I'm going to try to do is get a splitter to hook these up to. And I'm going to try to make a repeater out of two of these Bofang UV5R radios, which I know they're only 5 watt. If there's not another one, uh, a repeater in the area, 5 watts is better than nothing. I know some people like 
modern Rubicon put up a 50 watt out in California by using two mobile or two uh, two other radios that go in the vehicle. They're not handhelds. They're regular radios. And now he's got them mounted in his house and if he wants to take one out and put it in his Jeep it's going to be a little bit of work. So thanks for watching. Thumbs up, subscribe, and ring the bell for future videos. I appreciate you watching. I'll have another video for you later and maybe I'll mount one of these antennas outside and run it to one of these radios right here and see how it does as a base station at home and then I'm going to try to make a repeater out of two of these radios and see how that works it could be you know it's going to be fun to try you never know and anyway you guys have a great day I'll have another video for you soon see you later Oh, and Merry Christmas, cause it's a coming. <laughs>